Milbro back with Fangs. Uh, Dragon is not present for this episode. Next episode, at least, because uh, he has other obligations to do. He's uh, so he's not going to be present for a couple episodes. But we're back at it again. Uh, keep him going. Uh, overnight, uh, Fangs uh, actually found a uh, AK-47 stock in the in one of the chests. So I've actually got an AK-47 now at level 310. So. I'm really happy to see that, which means I need to go find, uh, I need to really work on getting brass and uh, lead together for ammunition. Um, uh, let's just take a little look here. Ah yes, the, the, the forge is still burning even though there's nothing to smell and it's got 600 minutes worth of fuel. <laughs> burning, burning till the end of time. Um, now I'm curious to see this, if it's, if I'm, if it's actually true, because I remember he, like, I just want to test this for myself, folks, but, um, I just want to see if I can actually take some dukes and actually turn it into brass, so, just gonna take, like, we're not gonna do too much here, but. 793 dukes, that'll, that'll be fine. Um, I'm also thirsty, gotta check for water. Don't need my character yelling at me about it, or heaving at me about it. Dying uh, of drought. <laughs> yes, dry, dying of drought. I mean, we'll, we'll go get that sorted a little bit, guys, but I'm uh, also working on more steel pickaxes for my quality increases. Uh, we've gone up to 398, but now we're up to level 412 steel pickaxe. Still four more on the craft. Not really caring about the tool XP at this point. So we're going to take the lead, and then we're going to just combine it, but... No! <laughs> Unfortunately, they don't let you... They don't let you smelt Duke's tokens anymore. Dang. Yeah, I I was wondering if that was uh, that was a possibility, but sadly not. Cannot smelt dukes into 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 brass for for casings, guys. That that's really sad. But um, we gotta. I gotta. <laughs> thankfully, I got like 240 jars on me, so just gotta go and and uh, grab some water. But um. It's a, you know, did some fertilization of the farm overnight, working on that stuff. Um, you know, got potatoes and corn growing at the moment. We're working on getting that production up. The, the potatoes are fully fertilized and got two rows of corn that are fertilized up. So, we're running over here to take a look at, because uh, one of the pools have the, well, one of the houses have, have a pool that we can... Yoink, uh, so. Oh! Hello, Bob. Bob's the one, uh, Bob heard me coming up uh, with the mini bike and then, uh, decided to have a word with me about, uh, uh, dipping his pool. Oh, got all the jars. I mean, I'm at 40%, 4% water, but we'll get that cooked up. So. I got, some, I got six, uh, Casings. Six casings, so wonderful. I'm not well, being making our way. <laughs> not trying to be sarcastic on that. I'm like, if I'm going to start using the AK, then I'm going to need a lot of sub six twos. <laughs> and any one piece will be as helpful as possible. <laughs> yep. Two. It's just sad that I. What would be really helpful though would be if I found a lead vein. Just, just give me, just some, somebody give me all the bullets in the world. I need them. Uh, uh, what was I doing here? Uh, oh, I had, I had seven. I had anvil in a working stiff's crate. Oh yeah, you sometimes find those. The one thing I don't really find that useful is, um, ah, uh, wait, the. 
the calibers and tool and die, because I'm like, I don't really find myself making a lot of rocket, uh, rocket launcher ammunition. I'm like, that, and that's basically all they're used for. Mm. Make, making rocket launcher uh, ammunition parts. I'm like, why? Just why? Ooh, some extra rebar frames. <laughs> I'll take those. But I love how I go, I go find, I go get, like, do fill up 240 jars in a matter of five seconds, and I come back to the campfire, and then I find uh, that I'm, I'm, uh, what? That I have seven. What? I found two uh, anvils and six mechanical parts in one thing. <laughs> if anything, those anvils are worth a lot of iron in the forge. Yeah. Wait, you can smelt them. Yeah, you can smelt them in. Ooh. I'll yeah, you take the. You can uh, smelt tools into the forge too. More resources for me. Yeah, if you Ooh, if you want to take if you want to take the time to smelt the uh, tools and anvils into the into the forge, it's like yeah, you can. It's like you get more iron than scrapping them. Jeez, two more anvils. <laughs> it's raining anvils like it's Looney Tunes. Ah. <laughs> like no, it's raining anvils as if it's a Minecraft trap. It's too bad you can't place anvils and use like Minecraft where you're just like or like attach them to a rope that you just pull and just be like Neem bonk. Just yeah. hear just just suddenly you have a pancake zombie. Oh, uh, if you come to me, I found an exploding crossbow bolt, uh, schematic, because I already have- I know it already. I think I might have it- let me check the workbench really quickly. Because I- th I thought I might have read that before. Um... Workbench, where you at? I was getting lost in my base. Um... Yeah, I know the exploding crossbow bolt. Go ahead and read it. Actually, you know what, you can- you could bring it over to me because I'll take the weaponsmithing point since yeah, you're already maxed. I, I already am maxed on weaponsmithing. Yeah, it was like in my street world, folks. It's like, uh, I found like a mini bike book out of a have an airdrop, and uh, I'm like, I can I completely forgot because like with my big building project over there that I've been doing, it's like I already maxed out my miscellaneous crafting, and I'm like, and I'm like, oh. It's already. This is already done. Yeah. Like. Yeah, it's like they're useful, like you know, up until you get level 100 to, for you know, getting the skill points and everything. But once you kind of max it out, it's not really that. Not really that entertaining. It's like y'all. You know, they're kind. Of, they're just good for selling to traders at that point. How is my character able to run? I have five anvils on me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's seven days. Don't question it. I'm I'm almost as strong as the Minecraft character at this point. I'm nearly as strong as Steve. <laughs> <laughs> I'm considering uh, you can you can carry a old mini bike in your inventory, and with no problem whatsoever. It's it's not surprising. Alright, I'm nearly towards you. Yeah, folks, I'm I'm gonna work on trying to actually work on trying to uh, dig out the pit some more and uh, try to dig down. So I'm gonna do that, and uh, I will. I think, uh, and hopefully that will that won't take too long. But I'll time lapse it for you, folks.
folks, I've dug out some more blocks of uh, the pit. It, I didn't get too much done because realizing that a lot of the a lot of the progress I uh, need to make is like it's gonna, gonna take a while, and I don't want to take up the whole day with the you know just time lapsing everything. Just get a couple more pickaxes merged. We're up to level 468. So, um, it's gonna take a lot of work to get through, and I realize, like, I messed up in the, in this, uh, by building, starting to build a, a concrete foundation with all the, uh, whatever you call it, you know, building a concrete foundation and everything on there. So, that's, I unintentionally made that a little bit harder on myself, but, Eh, it's a challenge I'll take, so... Um... I'm thinking of... Doing a little bit more... Here. Let's go over and check out the, uh... Well, I was thinking of maybe checking out the western town, but... We'll go and uh, look for some loot over in the... In the... Whatever... Uh... In, like, you know, the southern portion of town and see what's respawned. Like I say, we'll get that dug out. I'll get that dug out and worked on. So, on the overnights. Just want to kind of keep uh, content go you know, fresh and not too... And I don't want to have it be boring for you guys. So... Um... Let's try and find a house that I haven't looted in this town. We do have the loot respawn turned on, but sometimes it's a... Uh, it takes you know, a while. Yep. It's set to like 10 days, I believe. So. Um, I'll go to like the south, uh, southeast corner. Check it out. And Did I just get caught on fire? Were you standing on top of the campfire or forge? No. I ran past it and then started taking damage. <laughs> So we got a flammable fangs. Again. <laughs> oh, a screamer! Oh, lovely! They're screaming! <laughs> fangs go like a scream for me. Oh, a bee! Oh, sh a feral! <laughs> <laughs> uh. So Fangs is apparently having a party. Not a pleasant one. I mean, you might be able to get more magnum parts if a barrel shows up. No, there take, we go. Finally take it out. The beat. Taking out zombies in the uh, in the funeral home. Well, the barrel uh. just became a cripple. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh. Oh, I maxed out a stack of painkillers. Nice. And one of the coffins gave me fertilizer. Alright, shot off another leg of the pharaoh. Which iron armor schematics did you need? Uh, the chest piece. That's all? That's all. Yep, just the chest piece. Okay. okay. I'm just gonna read this uh, iron glove schematic. Yeah, because I recently gained the glove schematic. Uh, we'll check you out. Oh, level 136 magnum frame. A couple duct tape. What you got? Nothing in you. We'll go check out the... Uh, whatever you call it, the... the... Another bee! In the sky! <laughs> da 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 <laughs> right of the Valkyries. I have to go and actually grab my ammo now. Oh, a bear! Zombie bear! <laughs> Outside your base. Oh, they tend to spawn over there. Yeah, it's more up in between your base and my base. Yeah, we'll just uh, mine that up. And it fell into my pitfall trap! I- Oh, a cop zombie! I need help! You'll be fine. Uh, it's in my pitfall. I do need help. 
<laughs> You're saying your Magnum can't take him out? Not fast enough. I also have a bear to deal with. Yeah, I know it's worse. <laughs> Sir, I have some high quality materials I don't want getting sent to waste. Your precious steel? Uh, yeah. But My steel spikes. Your fangs. The they're meant to. They're meant to take out zombies, not just stay, sit there and look pretty. Yeah, I know. They're also getting whacked on by zombies. So I haven't finished the actual thing because it's only one block layer around it. I'll come. Oh, well, let's go over there and uh, get you. Another screamer. Well. Impromptu rescue mission, everybody. Uh, it blew up. The cop? Yeah. How much damage? I don't know. I haven't checked. Well, I mean, has he taken out any... Just outright blown up any blocks? I can't really tell. Um, drive him back That's over now. Part. I think you're good. I'm just now able to get headshots. The next yeah, thing you three know, or four headshots in a row. Next thing you know, Scream responds in for you. A couple more cops and zombie bears. I'm coming over just to be absolutely sure. So you already got me driving back over. Oh, impromptu rescue mission. Uh, drive back by the farm. Yeah, I do love having high accuracy. Okay. We'll check out the damn turf, folks. Oh, another screamer. Where? She, uh, like, uh, over by the screamer pit. Oh. Oh, Is hey. it towards my base? No, she's following me around, and I got a, I got a feral white. A feral white? I'm in the pit! Ah! I heard ya. Nah, it's okay. I got the feral white with an AK. All right. Uh, yeah, I'm just letting the screamer. Oh, a second feral has shown up. Here, well, one just went down. So, uh, and you, and this is why I say that I was one more. Yeah, seven six twos because stuff like this. Ah, a cop has shown up. Um, well, I guess, uh... I can't see the cop. He's over by the farm. Yeah, that's out of render distance for me. Yeah, I know. No worries, I got him taken care of. Screamer down. We'll clear out the rift raft first. Come here, guys. A second cop has shown up. Taking out the little ones and take care of you. Oh, there's spit. All right, you can go away, please. Get out of here, little lady. I'm trying to I'm trying to take out cops. Oh, one exploded. Uh, we'll take care of you. Oh, cop ex both cops exploded. Dang. I got caught in the radius of one, but I didn't die. How low? Only 62 HP. Not too bad. Like, I wasn't in the direct... I, I wasn't, like, right next to him. Thankfully. Uh, uh, someone... Oh! A little bit more help. Ah! Darn nurse sprained my leg! <sighs> Darn nurse. First was a crawler, and she decided to spray my leg. 
Oh, you're down the pit. Yeah, there was a couple zombies uh, hanging out in here in the pit. Uh, yeah. How'd you get up and down? Oh, I there... see a staircase. Yeah, I have a little staircase built up. Um, now let's go check out the feral, uh, the feral loot. See what the, let's see what's in there. No oh, Tori. Just got, just got to locate their, their bodies. Um. Oh, hey, would you look at that? Another AK stock. And we got, and there's a couple Magnum grips. Uh, we'll check the other one just to see. I don't think that was the feral, because zombie body had had some glasses for me. Um, uh, I know there was another feral around here. Uh, where is that? Usually you can tell. It's it's a feral by the unless that was the that was unless that was the feral with the glasses, but I'm like usually they drop such they drop a lot. Feral with glasses? No wait, I think I might have found him. I think I I cause uh, I just found one I just found a body with with twenty seven six twos and some shotgun shells. Uh. That wouldn't have been a cop because I. Because uh, both of them exploded, but um, yeah. I think I think that's not too bad of not too bad of Leo at all, considering I got a good uh, well at least I got another AK stock out of the deal. So uh, mm -hmm. we'll just grab you down, make a splint. Just gotta wait for all this and. I'll get put. Actually, check my s check the stock. It's a. T I mean that that's like the second weakest part, I think. Yeah. So um, let me put some stuff up here, folks. Uh, we'll just see how much of a quality increase I get out of this. Just from the just from a little upgrade in the stock. It's like it's not the best, but. We're we're not too worried about it. Um, pull the AK into the inventory. We'll grab the stock off that and grab that new stock. And we are going to get ready for a a nice uh, upgrade. Two eighty three stocks. So that's yeah. It's basically on par with my barrel. But it's up to level three eleven. Not much mm. of an upgrade, but it's every little bit helps. Now this sucks upgrading spikes. Oh, because of all the iron and all that? No, each hit only does two percent. Oh, just putting the steel like uh, repairing it with steel? Yeah. Ah, that really sucks. But um Splint that up, and let's actually, we'll actually go drive back over to the, to the other, you know, go back to the house I was wanting to loot. Well, and then we'll end off the episode, folks, but we'll just drive what right back over. the house you wanted to loot? It was over in the south, the southeastern corner of town. Uh. So I basically had to drive across town to help you out. Uh, hey, that big of a thing, I can run that within a minute. Well, one thing is, uh, with sometimes uh, time can be very precious, and you have to run over there. Like we were talking, like in the over in the by the funeral home. That's not that far. I know. It's just that, like, yo. Know, Sometimes, like, you know, especially if, like, your stamina's not being that great, it can, it can be uh, a little bit of a pain. Mm. Alrighty. Back to what we were doing before. Fangs and us cry for help. Um, I think there was a gun safe in here. Nothing in that backpack. I already looted this stuff, but 
Let's break in here. And... There we are. Let's just check to see what's in this gun safe, folks. I think there's one more safe down... down below. Uh... Are you checking... what... what building are you checking? It's the... it's the house north of the, um... Uh, uh, the funeral home. Uh... Just got some shotgun... got shotgun parts, magnum grip, and shotgun short stock, and hunting rifle stock with pistol grip. And then I think there's... I'm pretty sure there's like another safe to check in an office. Uh, um... Oh, that was already... I, th I can't... I don't remember if I already loot that one, but... We'll just... I'm, I probably loot it as you were... I had him for help, so... Um, bookshelves... Mm. Got a leather boot schematic and a rocket launcher schematic. That's in the that's in the that's in the bedroom of of the house. So, um, oh, uh, purse gave me a pistol with some extra ammunition. That lady was ready to defend herself. She was packing heat. <laughs> now it would have uh, been funnier if it was a full AK. I'd be going, holy crap! <laughs> that is one thing I've actually never seen. Uh, like. That is one thing I've actually ever seen, like, drop completely on this version. And, like, I saw, I saw, like, a video, like, with a thumbnail, like, someone saying, like, they found a fully crafted AK-47. I'm like, I'm not ruling out the possibility, but I've never seen a full AK-47 drop before. Like, I've only ever seen, it, like, you know, you know, pieces uh, drop, like, once, maybe, like, two pieces at a time, like, from ferals or... For gun store boxes. I've never seen, like, the only time I've ever seen, like, a fully crafted. I think I've ever seen a fully crafted AK 47 is from a trader. Mm. And to me, and it's like, keep in mind, I'm not saying, you know, it, it's still a full AK at the end of the day, but I'm like, that's a different story as compared to uh, finding a fully, you know, like, one out in the wild, like, you know, just sitting in a box somewhere. But that's going to be about it for today's episode on YouTube. Uh, if you made it this far and you enjoyed it, uh, hope you uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Helps the channel out a lot. Have a great day and take care.